Ladies and gentlemen, my sponsor has a Christmas sale going on for 17% off using my code Demer. So if you guys want MT to build the God Squad, go to my site, A6K. It's $9 for 100K, man. $9 for 100K with 17% off is dumb cheap. <laughs> Once you do that, tweet you on Twitter, you know what I'm saying? Give you a follow back, use my code, and uh, build that God Squad you always wanted. Enjoy the video, guys. I'll catch y'all later. Ladies and gentlemen, how are we doing here today? We're back with another video. As you can see on the screen, I got another pink diamond Larry Nance. Just wanted to show you guys that I don't really know. We're here on the triple threat boards, but that is not the premise of today's video. How are we doing here today, ladies and gentlemen? Are you boys back with another video? We streamed earlier today, and as you guys probably saw, if you, if you tune by in the stream, we got the man himself, Pink Diamond, double A Ron Ford. But that's not the video here today. See, the video here today is you can get a card that is better, or at least on the same level, in my opinion, as the Galaxy Opal Damian Lillard that's gonna come out for free. Literally for free. This card is for free. And if you guys can't tell what I mean, I literally mean this Galaxy Opal Baron Davis card. Now, why I'm making this type of video is because Damian Lillard and Baron Davis, if you don't know, are pretty much the exact same card, except there's one key difference. Now, I wanna show you something, okay? So flash this up on the screen. Now, I compare Damian Lillard, his Onyx, that's a 96 overall, to Baron's 97. You don't need to see the stats because Galaxy Opal Lillard is gonna have obviously really good stats. Stats aren't what I'm looking at here. I'm looking at the signatures, okay? I see every single thing in shooting is the same. Literally everything. Guys, they have all of the same shooting. So, so both of these guys, when you're pulling up shooting movings, if you shoot a post fade, it's all gonna be the damn same. You can see that when you play in the game too. Everything is the same. You can see the post. Everything is the same. You can see the layups and dunks. Everything is the same. If you can't tell what I'm getting at here, everything is a copy and paste except for hint, the dribble moves. Okay, now really quickly before we get into the dribble moves, the reason why I'm saying this is I'm assuming Baron Davis, people have tweeted out that he's going to get Showtime dunks because if you guys don't know, Baron Davis has Showtime or Highlight Film. It's Showtime on current gen. It's Highlight Film on next gen. Pretty much every year that they're gonna update Baron and give him Showtime dunks. So he will have even more dunks, so I wouldn't worry about that. But the main reason why I would think that this free Baron Davis is actually gonna be better than Galaxy Opal, Damian Lillard, is simply because his dribble moves. Now, you don't have to be a dribble god to be better with this card than he would Lillard. Now, the only reason why I think some people might think Lillard might be better is because badges, he might have Hall of Fame range. But if you look at if you look at Baron Davis's badges, he has 12 Hall of Fames. Damian Lillard might come up more, but the only one that I think that's going to actually make a huge difference of anything is deep threes. And Baron Davis already has that on goal. For that sake, I will say... Damian Lillard has that, but one single badge, Deep 3 being Hall of Fame, I do not put that over the dribble moves of Baron Davis. Now, I don't know if I'm going to show you guys clips or not, but I'm going to take this into freestyle. Now, the reason why I'm making the case that Baron Davis is the better card is because, quite literally, like I said, you do not have to be a god to be good at dribbling in action. You really don't, okay? So, really quick, I just want to show you that he has all of Steph Curry's innovation. So, you see this through the legs that I'm spamming right here? Yeah, that's a really nice move. Now, try to do with Damian Lillard here. I tried to do with Damian Lillard here. You see, it's not the Ooh. same. It's not the same effect. It's not nearly as good. Spamming that through the legs is not nearly as good and or effective. Now, the thing is, obviously, if you guys don't know, Baron Davis also has the curry slot. Okay, so right there, you see that? That is Damian Lillard's version of the curry slot. And you guys obviously know the curry slot is a humongous part of last year and this year. And Baron Davis has it. He has it right here. You can sit there, spam it if you want. He has the curry slide, which honestly makes this card even 10 times better. If he didn't have the curry slide, he'd still be a good card. But since he has that animation, it makes him that much more better. The next thing that he has that's, that is better is the behind the back. Most people prefer the one I just showed you. That's the curry behind the back. If you don't know, Baron Davis has old curry drill moves, which are some of the best in the entire game. This is Damian Lillard's. This is Damian Lillard's, his behind the back. That's not a bad one. That's probably the second best in the game, but it does not compare to Curry's. I still like Curry's a ton better. The only thing that I get Lillard dribbling wise over Bear Davis is that you can sit here and spam like stuff like this. Is that if you try to spam like behind the back and then cross over, Baron Davis does it like maybe a little bit slower, but everything else dribbling wise is a lot better with Baron Davis. And that's the key thing that I'm trying to get it here. That's why you guys probably already seen a ton of gameplay. I already did a gameplay on Baron Davis yesterday or like two days ago. I just wanted to show you this because I was talking in a group chat and one of my other boys, okay? And we were just talking about, he brought it up really quick in which it was a really good point that I'll show you. I can use both of them in triple threat that the Galaxy Opal, Damian Lillard is quite literally, he is literally, you saw by the animations, the 
the exact same card. The only thing Damian Lillard is going to have over him is Deep 3's Hall of Fame because you know they're going to give Lillard that. They'll give Lillard Deep 3's Hall of Fame. Yes, that is big. He'll have that over him, but that does not come close to having three to four to five way better dribblers, especially the Curry signs behind the back. It does not come close to that. So I'll show you a triple threat. It's like going to be a perfect example. We're going to use we're going to use Damian Lillard and we're going to use Baron Davis. The separation you can create with Baron Davis's moves compared to Damian Lillard's is a world's difference. Don, if you want my boy, that's that's not going in. Let's get it, man. You got Onyx, Zion, Williamson, Zion. I don't know if that goes in. Okay. Now, not to say Lillard's going to be a bad card. Lillard's going to be a good card. Now, you can see it here. You can see the spam, too. Okay, Lillard is a W. Like, this card is good. You can see the behind the back there, too. It's good. Like, I can create space with this. But it does not, bro, it does not compare. It does not compare to how much space you can create with something like the Curry slide or Curry's behind the back. It just isn't. I'm just being honest. You guys know I can dribble. It just doesn't compare, fam. It really doesn't. So that's why I'm saying if you're thinking about card collecting, that's why I honestly want to make this video. If you're thinking about card collecting, you're on the fence. Not If you want to 100% get that uh, Damian Lillard, go for it. But if you're on the fence of collecting Damian Lillard or not, if you're like, eh, I kind of want to do it, I'm not sure, should I just keep collecting and see if I want it? I wouldn't. I'm going to be honest, I wouldn't. I think this card is better, especially because of the dribble moves. You create a lot more space doing it. I just don't see the reason. I literally don't see the reason when Baron Davis is the better, or at the very least, he's going to be on the same level as Galaxy Opal Baron Davis. I can guarantee he's going to be at least on the very same level. You can see all the gameplays you want. This is leaking out with Hayward. Okay, you can watch all the gameplays you want, but when you're in like a competitive match or when you're in like a tryhard match, you're going to want to create as much separation as possible. And what does that happen? The curry slide, the aggressive behind the back, those moves right there create the space that you need. Even though I bricked it, that's just me whitening the shot. You'll see here though, if you, if you didn't already from the start, Damian Lillard has the same fadeaway. They both have that one. You guys saw everything was the same except for these key drill moves, man. And that honestly is, it's a world's difference. It's literally a world's difference. This Baron Davis, I mean, y'all know, bro, this Baron Davis is different. Y'all literally know this, that this card is different. I played TTO earlier today. I probably could conjure up like 40 clips if I wanted to, because I have so many clips of just killing people with Baron Davis. Hell no, that's not going in. Yes, sir. I, I mean, you can cook up with Lillard too. It's just not to the same effect, you know what I mean? It's really not to the same effect. Not to say that the Galaxy Opal Lillard is going to be bad, though, because that card's going to be nice. It's just not going to be on the same level. It just doesn't create the same space. But we can say, but hey, we can still cook up with Lillard. Like I said, don't get it twisted. Lillard's still going to be a very good card. You still cook up with him, still going to be nice. Not to mention, too, they're probably going to juice Damian Lillard's defense. Like, I would have to imagine it's an Opal. You guys already know, too, Baron Davis, There's he's not lacking on defense. He has clamps. He has the badge. He has all the stats for it, too. So I don't know what Damian Lillard's defense is going to look like, but it, it has to at least be the same as Baron Davis, I would imagine. Because if not, that just makes Baron Davis even better. You see what I mean? Like, it's... But you can see the effect of the Curry Slide fan. So, I'm, I'm letting you know right now that both of the cards, like I said, are going to be good. But, this Baron Davis is the better card. It is quite literally that simple. You could be a hype beast and think that that little is better. I'm not mad at it. But I'm just letting you know, at the very least... These cards are on the same damn level, and you're wasting your damn MT if you go in there and spend all it just to get that, to get in hopes of what you think is like the best point guard in the game. I'm saying, hey, we got five seconds. It's no worries. Uh huh. Uh huh. It's no worries. It's no worries, man. I'm telling you, it's. Oh, this card's godly, man. This card's godly. Standing shot, moving shot, it doesn't matter. Dunking the cards. Defense, literally. This card is just godlike. If you're not doing anything, my boy, get off your ass and grind for this card. Because <laughs> holy shit. I'm still shocked that 2K deadass gave this card away for free. I'm like actually sitting here in shock. Thank you. Come again. Give me that dummy. Let's go. Good defense, AD. Hey, we got hit him with the nasty game. I could hit him with the leaner. You guys already know. I could hit him with a cheesy leaner. I'm not going to lie. Look at you. He's holding his nuts. He's holding his nuts. Hey, I got a rim take here. You get when you have these dribbles, man, you got the rim take every single time. On his head! Get off me, Zion! Jesus! This video's not even long either. I guess this is kind of like a quicker video today, but I'm just putting it out there as a strict warning to you guys. Like I said, I think if you get that Galaxy Opal Damian Lillard in hopes that he's the best card in the game, or at least the best point guard, Baron Davis is going to be at the very least on the same level and or better. I think he's going to be better. The dribbles make a world of difference. Ping Diamond Curry... Still, I hate to break your hopes, but he's still gonna be better than a card too. It is what it is. Okay, guys, if you guys enjoyed the video and or this helped, if you want another stream tonight, shit, let me know. Smash, smash the shit out of the like button. I'll catch you guys later. Hey man, take it easy. Get this damn card.